guys, welcome back to my channel. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so glad you decided to come back and have fun with me. Um, I'm really excited for today's video. We are doing a bedroom tour. But before we do that, um, we have like, some exciting things coming up. And one thing I want to do is an ask me anything video. So if you can leave your questions down in the comments, I'll answer them in the next video so you guys can get to know me a little bit more. Because I know some of you guys are new to me. Um, and I know some of you are from Instagram, but yeah. We'll just get a little bit more acquainted. Okay, let's get this tour started. Welcome to my room. So I think the most frequently asked question is about this wall. Um, a lot of people think that it is wallpaper, but it's actually not. It's hand-painted stencil, or hand-stenciled, I guess. Um, we used a wonderful company here at Little Rock called Angelfish, and one of her artists came over and stenciled, stenciled this entire wall, um, which I, I'm obsessed with it because it looks amazing. I really wanted something that was like silver and gold, and I couldn't find any wallpaper that I liked. Um, but I did like this pattern because it's big, it's bold, um, but then it's also a little bit muted with the gray wall. So really happy with that and it really just makes a statement. And I think it was about the same price as um, having the wall wallpaper. So um, yeah, we're just really happy with it. And it's just a great focal point. So I think the other question I get a lot is about these cabinets that we use as our side tables. Um, we like to like kind of do different things um, instead of using like traditional side tables. Um, in our last bedroom, we had like a desk on one side. Um, so these are cabinets, and they're from a store called At Home. Um, it's really affordable. It's like kind of like one of those um, I don't know, like a warehouse type store uh, where they just have like a bunch of stuff. And they originally had these really ugly knobs. They were like these big gold flowers. They were not cute. Um, so we just switched the knobs out and we switched the knobs out a lot. Um, we bought like a ton of different knobs to try on this um, cabinet. Uh, but yeah, we really love it. They're really tall. They hold a lot. I'm not gonna open them because they're really messy inside. Uh, but they just are really nice and like really sleek and just perfect for this room. Um, the lamps are from TJ Maxx, well, Home Goods. We go to Home Goods all the time because we don't have a lot of other like furniture accessory stores here. Um, so Home Goods is like our go-to. Um, and I finally found white lamps because they're actually really hard to find. It took me like a year. Um, so yeah, I love that. And then we just have some like decorative pieces here. This is Mike's side, of course. I put a picture of myself here so he can remember his beautiful wife and baby Creed when he was just a little itty bitty baby. Um, but I forgot to mention when I was on my side that the mirrors are from Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby, if you have one close to you, is a really great place to get mirrors because they're really affordable. And I've seen this out other places and they're like hundreds of dollars. These were 60. So, and they're super heavy, so they're quality, but they just don't cost a lot. We will move on to the bed. Um, this bed is from Wayfair, I believe. Again, it was really hard to find a white headboard, um, but we finally settled on this one. It's not super sturdy, but it looks good, and that's what we were going for. We just wanted like an all white room pretty much or mostly white when we got it everyone was saying that like you shouldn't get a white headboard it's going to get so messy with the baby uh, we haven't had any problems and as you can see we haven't had any stains on it so it's totally fine this pillow 
is from a shop on Instagram and you can just like order your pillows from her. And those are from TJ Maxx. My favorite thing on the bed is this Gucci throw, which you actually won't believe, but it's from Home Goods. It's from TJ Maxx. One year they had just like a huge stock of Gucci blankets. So of course we got one. Our chairs are also from, you guessed it, Home Goods. And we were looking for a bench or something to go right here because this is like a pretty big room. And I really wanted to just add a touch of pink in here just because it's so delicate. And um, they got them at a really great price. And I think they fit really nicely in here. And then our little middle table is from Dress for Less Ross. <laughs> and it was like $30. So this is really a, you know, cost effective room. So this is really a budget-friendly designed room. Nothing is super expensive in here, but it looks expensive, and that's what I was going for. We really love the rug in here. We really wanted something muted, um, but it had a little gray in it. So this rug is from Rugs USA, and they have a huge selection of rugs. It's really great prices, and we've really been happy with it. The only thing I haven't been happy with is that corner that will not stay down. Um, I literally tried everything. I put books on it, tape, I had like a rug tape, it, nothing worked. Michael finally got it to stay down, I don't even know how. But other than that, I'm really happy with the rug. These pictures, we love them so much. They were in our living room originally. Um, and then we got another picture from Angel Face because I felt like these were just a little too small. Um, these are from Lindsay Lutters and um, definitely follow her on Instagram. She has like beautiful art, so I just love those. And then, of course, we have these Eternity Roses that actually are Eternity because I've had them for like three years, and they're still they're still kicking. Probably the most expensive thing in the room is our dresser. We got it from Z Gallery. Um, I waited until they had a really good promotion. They don't have promotions that often that are like really good so I think I waited till after Christmas or Black Friday these are their Black Friday or after Christmas um, to get this and this was probably the most expensive thing but we really wanted it we didn't see any dressers that we liked more than this one it's pricey but it looks really good and then the last thing is our mirror I also get a lot of questions about the mirror for some reason um, also from Home Goods. Half of this room is from Home Goods. Uh, and it's by Tahari. And they actually have this style at Home Goods right now. Like they always have this style. Might not be this, uh, the long shape, but I've seen the round mirrors and they have square ones. Like they just have a ton of them with the same design. Um, so I think that's like a staple there. Oh, last but not least, the ceiling fan. I searched high and low for a modern ceiling fan and I finally found this one on house and then I had to try and figure out where to get it from and I finally ended up getting from this random lighting place. Um, I'll link or I'll put the description of what it exactly is called. It's called like quartz prism, something like that, but I'll put it below. Um, and I love it because it's clear and it just goes so well in this room. I think a lot of people don't think about changing the ceiling fans out, but it really is a small fix that really makes a big impact. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know what other videos you want to see and don't forget to leave your questions for me in the comments below and we will answer them on the next video. Thank you for stopping by and I will see you guys next time. Bye!